Yep, we picked the apples last week and I've been making applesauce and this is what we have left. So tonight's my night off and I'm going to be canning apples. And right here, this is the squash we have. And this one here is, I see there's a little hole here, so I'm going to cook that up tonight and then I'll freeze it. And then the fencing right here, my chicken coop, I need to work on my chicken coop. And this is inside my greenhouse. A couple nights ago it was supposed to freeze, so I brought my pepper plants in that were in containers. Now I just have to decide which ones I'm going to bring in and put in the basement biz. I do overwinter some of them. And I see this one right here has a nice little, hold on if you can see it, little chili peppers going on it. I think they're chili peppers. Oh, but yeah, but everything's still doing good in here. Lots of peppers. And right here I did end up getting one loofah. Yeah, but the other ones were are just too little. And then my tomatillas, I've been picking them and putting them in my salsa. And you can tell by these leaves that we did get a slight freeze in the other night. And I see right here the birds are starting to eat my sunflowers already. Right there. So I'm going to have to cut them heads. So this is what I ended up with when I cut the sunflowers. I wish I could have left them out there a little longer, but like I said, the birds were getting them. And then I found this. I thought it was a pumpkin, but it's a squash. I did leave a couple sunflowers I'll show you for the birds. These are the ones I left for the birds because they're not really very big right now. And I think I have enough of them already. And the bees like them. To dry these sunflowers, all I'm going to do is stick them in the back of the van here, so nothing gets to them. And this right here is Matilda. The mother chickens are mean to her. She's okay at night when she goes into roost, they leave her alone, but during the day they're mean to her. She's with the one of the older ones I have, she's five years old. So I've been letting her out during the day. And that's why I have to work on my chicken coop. I have to figure something out. And then I have to bring my goldfish in for the winter. I have a room in the basement where I keep my plants and my fish. I just have to get my aquarium set up. But that's all guys.